My name is Crystal and this is Taryn. When Taryn was born, she was born with multiple um, disabilities. She had trouble eating, she had trouble breathing, and one of the main things that kept her in the hospital for a really long time was her apnea. She had central and obstructive apnea, and um, it was while she was asleep, but it was also while she was awake. So after being in the hospital for 102 days, one of the main things that we had to have in order to be able to bring her home was a pulse oximeter because otherwise there's no way we would have been able to bring her home. So having that equipment has given peace of mind so that um, I can sleep, so I can take a shower, so that no matter where I am in the house, I know that she's doing okay. Another thing that, um, that we dealt with a lot was pneumonias and respiratory infections. She has been hospital hospitalized many, many, many times for um, respiratory infections. And at one point, the doctors were not gonna even let her go back home after one of her hospitalizations because um, she didn't have anything at home, any kind of CPAP or anything. And the social workers at the hospital called many, many, many different agencies and nobody was willing to work with our insurance and get us, it was over Christmas holidays, nobody was willing to come out that close to the holidays, so basically we were kind of stuck in the hospital. Um, but then they called Barnes and a representative came out and he came, he did all the paperwork, he brought the machine and we were able to be home for Christmas. She still has that machine and um, that is something that we still rely on at home. Another thing that she has that we get through Barnes is um, an oxygen concentrator. And it's not something that she has to have every day, but when she does have a respiratory infection, that's something that we need. Um, before, any time that her stats were low or she was congested, that basically meant we had to stay in the hospital. But since she has the oxygen at home, and the doctors know that we have that, then we're able to monitor things at home instead of having to stay in the hospital and ultimately end up contracting even more germs while we're there. So we've been a client of Barnes for seven years and we are very, very thankful that they're here. Um, after Hurricane Michael, they showed up in our driveway even though there was no communication to make sure that we had everything we needed and we're just very thankful that we have them to meet our needs. Whenever I call for resupplies, they're usually here within a day to max. The, the biggest obstacle we've had in the past was insurance, but Barnes has been really good about working through the insurance complications that we've had.